Today I'm going to make another reaction video uh, for the world record dive. Uh, today is going to be uh, constant no fins, constant weight no fins. Uh, this is a world record dive made by Italian freediver Alessia Zucchini. I hope this time I pronounced your name correctly. Uh, last time when I was talking about this incredible uh, freediver, I was think made a big mistake in her uh, family name. I hope today I was correct. So Alessia Zucchini uh, made uh, this world record dive during the uh, competition in the vertical blue competition uh, on Bahamas. Uh, it was uh, last year in July, something like this. So during this competition, Alessia made a few world records. Uh, we already watched one in a discipline free immersion. It is when free diver pulling himself or herself in this case uh, down and up using the rope. And today we're going to watch constant no fins. What is a constant no fins? It is a kind of purest freediving discipline. It is a when freediver uh, diving down, descending and then ascending uh, without using uh, the rope or without using bifins or monofin. Just, uh, just simply using arms and legs. So this is why it's obviously the hardest discipline and uh, it's also, uh, like I said, the purest freediving discipline. All right, guys, we see Alessia uh, Zucchini doing her, her preparation, uh, same as uh, previous dive, uh, same as when she was doing free immersion. Uh, she is among the free diving athletes who uh, keep using the goggles. Uh, again, it used to be really popular, then less free divers starts using the liquid goggles. Uh, she is still using it. She also have a nose clip. We discussed on my previous reaction video that some free divers prefer to keep this uh, to keep this position on the surface when they're lying uh, on the surface like this, and some, for example, Alexei Molchanov, uh, they prefer to be in an upright position. Okay, Alessia finished her preparation. She finished her packing and start her dive. As you can see, she doesn't use a fin or monofin, uh, just arms and legs. Beautiful technique at this moment. This is a like if you want to uh, see the excellent no fins technique, you just can rewatch rewatch your dive because this is just. I mean, a, again, in my opinion, uh, this is as close as perfect dive as it can be. So she is 16 meter deep already after a few arm strokes and kicks. Uh, she have a lanyard uh, attached to her waist. Uh, some athletes uh, don't like this uh, configuration for the lanyard, but uh, she's using it. Oh, maybe I'm wrong. No, no, she it's attached to her waist. Why some uh, free divers criticize this configuration for the lanyard? Uh, they just don't like the idea that in case if let's say free diver uh, have to be pulled up by the counterbalance system they afraid that it's gonna it's gonna be hard so the concern for the safety okay alessia is 30 meter deep uh, she started doing less arm stroke and kicks uh, she i guess she's already negative buoyant uh, but she still keep uh, keep doing uh, arm strokes and kicks okay 40 meters Looks like she start free falling. No, not yet, not yet. Uh, so 50 meters. Maybe she start free falling now. Okay, what I want you guys keep attention on is uh, how relax your ankles and how re relax your arms. Incredible relaxation. You see that they are like slightly moving because of the water movement. So it means that there is a zero tension there. Perfect streamlined position. Perfect streamlined position, um, beautiful dive. Already 66 meter deep, 70. So probably she heard alarm uh, from your free dive computer and then she knows that uh, the end of the rope is coming. So now with your right arm, she is grabbing the stopper, boom. And now with her left arm, She's going to grab the tag and she put it, I guess, I guess under her hood. Okay. And now this is the hardest part. Now this is a lot of work have to be done to reach the surface. 
it's much more easy to pull the rope or kick using the fins but this no fins discipline require so much energy so so far she's doing it beautifully uh, she's already 50 meter deep constant arm stroke kicking arm stroke kicking arm stroke kicking because there is no gliding okay what we start seeing around 40 meter depths that your position became slightly compromised I guess now the dive is getting pretty hard but still like the still arm stroke and kicks up okay I think she came too close to the rope uh, first safety divers meeting her at 30 meters yes we clearly see that position is compromised but she's still kicking pretty strong no concerns for the safety divers um, yeah the body position is slightly compromised but she's already 10 meters away from the surface no questions that she's going to reach it okay now she start floating up because remember now she is a really positive buoyant uh, and she's she, she not she she couldn't just pull herself using the rope uh, but she float up okay she grabbed the rope she grabbed the rope as we can see the color of her skin um, it's not the same so a bit whitish bluish so obviously uh, she has not that much oxygen but everything so far done nicely she show okay for the judge keep doing her recovery remove the goggles and the judge is gonna say white card what do you think yeah come on you know that it's gonna be white card because as i said this is a world record and now huge congratulations for these athletes so guys as you saw this is the hardest discipline this is where the athlete have to work the most this is why don't be surprised when you see the world records in a no fins discipline uh, they are less than in others so for example you saw before that let's say the world record uh, with a monofin it is 122 meters right if i'm if i'm correct but with the no fins it is a 74 meters and it's not because the no fins just like no one interested it's just because it's much much harder to do and guys uh I think I forgot to say you at the beginning of this video, the link to the original video is going to be in the description below. Uh, this uh, original video in a vertical blue uh, YouTube channel. You can watch the full video. It is a uh, video from the day three during the last year uh, vertical blue competition. I hope you like this video. And if you want to learn more about how to do uh, no fins diving, whether in a pool or in the ocean, uh, check out uh, the video here and if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet click here